Hey, I'm Chris from Bushwraps. Today we're going to be removing Bushwraps Pro and the signage off the side of Matt from Explore Life 79. This has been on there for three years, so hopefully it comes off nice and easily. Let's go take a look. Today. So for anyone that follows Matt, you know that he's not afraid to get into situations. So as you can see here, the fender has definitely been up to something. I'm not gonna ask what happened, but we're gonna remove it off and see what's underneath. When it comes to removing film, there's many options you can do. Heat gun, you can do hair dryer. Being out in the sun is fantastic. And also I'm using hot water. All you wanna do is essentially I'm gonna lift this edge because this is our Bushwraps Pro. It is all wrapped edges. I'm gonna lift these edges up all the way around and I'm gonna stretch the film off on a 90 degree angle from the panel. If I tear back on it, it'll leave adhesive behind. Whereas if I stretch it and pull it upwards, the adhesive will stay on the film. Therefore, I'm gonna skip the step afterwards of getting adhesive remover and removing it all off. Thank you God for waking me up today. This is definitely the worst part of it. I'll try and show you what happens if I pull back on it and see if it will leave adhesive. It does this now and then. Can't be certain if it's gonna show you this in the video. As you can see, as soon as I pull back, you can see the adhesive still staying on the vehicle. Whereas if I stretch up, there's the adhesive there. No adhesive left on it. It stayed on the film. So as long as you're not pulling the film back on itself, as long as you stick to stretching it outwards or back towards this way, you'll reduce the chances of adhesive being left on the vehicle. As you can see, we're getting close to where the damage is. I gotta let you know, this film is not bulletproof. It can stop stone chips and sticks, but if you hit it hard enough or scrape it hard enough, it will go through it. So we're gonna peel this off all the way and double check the paintwork and show you guys that it's either done its job or it's not. Hopefully no paint damage. There is no paint damage. This is just adhesive that's been left on. With a solvent, I'll be able to get all that adhesive off and this panel will be looking perfect. The Pro has definitely done its job. The paint protection has held up, even though it did look very damaged. It's, it's perfect. Alrighty guys, Tom from the Explore Life here today. I've brought the 79 down to the team of Bush Wraps down at Waycoal, getting ready for the giveaway. And I just want to show you a quick little thing while they're taking the, one of the final walls off. So back in the Cape in 2022, Matty slammed the 79 up against a wall doing a big river crossing. So he slammed this four and a half ton truck up against a wall and it did protect minorly, but it's not completely bulletproof. If you slam this truck up against anything, nothing's gonna protect it. But we did slam it just here as well on the same wall and that, we're gonna rip that off and that's gonna be completely fine. That's gonna be beautiful. You won't even be able to tell the difference. But yeah, the whole car's coming out absolutely mint. Someone is gonna be very happy with how this thing has turned out. Woo! Look at that. So this thing, as you've seen on the Explore Life YouTube channel, it's been around Australia. It's probably done Australia two or three times. Maddie has flogged this thing until it almost can't no more, but the bush wraps has completely covered all the pinstripes, all the minor damages. The paint is immaculate. Like you should see this car. It is that nice. The canopy, you can see even in the bush wraps, like there are pinstripes all over it, all over the tray, all over the toolboxes but this big canopy door is still in brand new condition. Matty, he's gotta be happy with that. Oh. Oh. Holy moly. That is actually insane. How good does it look? <laughs> Hell yeah.
bit of adhesive from the wrap, but that, that is so impressive. Like, you can't even make that up. Like, we'll try find a bit of footage so the boys can throw it over, but Maddie literally had the Patriot on the back of this thing up in, on the old Telegraph track, and whoosh, straight onto a wall. And look at it. That's actually insane. Yeah. Yeah, bushwhacks. Thank <laughs> you.